Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is the USDA plant hardiness zone map of Florida. If you live in Florida, definitely give this map a look. This is going to give you an idea of the low temperatures in your area, your zone, and based off of that information, you'll know what type of fruit trees are going to do good in your yard. I put a pin drop where I'm located in Pasco County. And on the right hand side, we can look at what zone I'm in. Based off of the shade color here, it's zone 9B and my low is 25. Now, I have not seen 25 in my yard. I have seen 27. And at that point, we do have to cover the tropicals. Mangoes, star fruit, Jamaican cherry, all has to be covered once we get that low. If we go up to Tallahassee, let's zoom out a little bit. Tallahassee's low is 10. So you're definitely going to be able to grow your stone fruit, peaches, plums. Citrus is going to do very well up there. Persimmon. But when it comes to tropicals like the mangoes, jackfruit, star fruit, you're really not going to be able to pull it off unless if you have a heated greenhouse. Ocala, your zone 9A, you can definitely grow mangoes. But you're going to have to protect it with either Christmas lights or you need a greenhouse. Very close to me is Clearwater. Let's see their zone. 10A. They can grow ultra tropical. So they can grow coconuts. They do not have to protect their mango trees. If we go down to Miami. 11A. They can pretty much grow all the tropicals, but they're going to have a hard time with stone fruit because they won't have enough chill hours. So Orlando, zone 9B. So your low is going to be 25. So that's the video today. It's what I wanted to share with you guys. Take a look at this map and thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.